Uh, soccer was my sport until sophomore year of high school, until I just kind of got sick of, you know, all the politics that went into it, because, you know, I felt I was better than a lot of the guys, but who's that, who am I to say? But, so, I want to try something new, I wanted to get into hitting, and wanted to get into some of the football stuff, because I would always played backyard football with my buddies, and I tried to play football, and next thing you know, I was kicking on varsity my, uh, my sophomore year. Yes, very much so. Uh, um, when Podlish, Adam Podlish let me kick, I mean, it, it was mostly usually extra points, mm -hmm. you know, maybe once in a while a short field goal just to get my experience in. And then senior year was the real year that it was like me, myself only. And that's all I did was kick. And I, I just fell in love with it because I had all the responsibility, punting, kicking off, doing extra points, field goals. I got to do everything. And that's when I finally just like accepted it. That's what I wanted to do. My senior year, uh, we're playing Fairport on homecoming mm -hmm. uh, at Pittsburgh. Uh, really close game, just like the CIFL championship game. Back and forth, score, score, coming down. And the whole time, I'm just thinking, oh, man, what if, what if it happens? What if I get a chance to win the game on a kick? Mm -hmm. And sure enough, we drive down. Frewster makes a catch. Peterson makes a catch. Next thing you know, the time's running out. I don't even, I'm, I'm practicing still. And the coach calls, field goal. My unit's already out there. And I run out. And it was just like instant, just put it down. And I just kicked it as hard as I could. And it went in. It was just, that was probably the yeah, greatest football moment. Uh, one of my uh, defensive linemen on Brockport was uh, getting recruited by them, mm -hmm. and he was going to a couple of the practices. And I was, I just asked him. I was like, "Hey, man, ask, get get the word out, see if they need a kicker or something." And I got a couple phone calls here and there. And then I ended up personally just calling the player personnel director, Mark Thurston, mm -hmm. and he set it up uh, when the tryout was going to be and everything. And try to end up being on a Sunday at Total Sports. Went out there. Just try to do my best, and they said that I was the kicker. So, as a player, you know, Adam is probably one of the most accurate kickers in this league. I, I feel we have the best kicker in the league. Mm -hmm. um, you know, the, the kid, he works hard. He's got a great leg, and, and I can't say much more about him. He's got great character, great kid. Um, he's just, he's just a good character, character mm -hmm. kid. It took a little bit to get used to because when we first started, when I first started two years ago, uh, it was at the Main Street Armory, mm -hmm. and we didn't have a scoreboard up there. It was just a big, high arching ceiling, so I just I could just kick away. Mm -hmm. So then when we went to Blue Cross, it was a little getting used to, but the refs actually um, on field goals they'll let you move four yards to the right or four yards to the left uh -huh. away from the scoreboard. But I mean, it's even more it's almost even more challenging because you have a you got the angle plus the the you know only small uprights to aim at. So, but you know, it just just more practice to work on, you know. He actually made I want to say three field goals that game, mm -hmm. and the one he made in the fourth quarter uh, put us up ten points. It's probably the biggest kick in uh, franchise history. So yes, uh, I will say that was a big one. That actually probably won us a championship. After I kicked that ball, and I was just like, <sighs> it's just like yes, you know, just a really really good feeling. Yeah, it was last year. Um, I drove out there, and they found out that I was a student still. I was still enrolled in SUNY Brockport, so they didn't officially let me try out. Mm -hmm. But I did I did do some kicks with the, um, Bobby April watching me, and they said they were interested, and hopefully, I mean, hopefully the invitation's still open. <laughs> Better come back to the window, bro.